Hello friends, welcome. So in this video, again, I'm going to work with the API resources. And if I go to the Insomnia, here we have the get resource for this specific ID, and we get all the data of that post. So post ID, title, body, and created that. And uh, this is coming from the post resource. So what we added here. Now let me go to the web roads. And here I'm going to copy this and create one more. And display here all the all the posts. So post all. And let me say here posts. And now instead of saying new post, I'm going to say post resource. And static method of collection, and here add the all the posts. Let's save this one, and now go to the Insomnia. Make a send request, and now we have all the posts with the, this data we added here. So if we make a change here, so here we have a post ID. Let's remove this one. Save it send data and now we have id let's remove the created art and also the body and yeah now we have the id and title not much more okay let's me do one more thing if i open the posts uh, table here i'm going to add also the user id so dollar sign table and i'm going to say unsign big integer for the user id let's save this one and also open the post factory and here i'm going to say user id is going to be one because i think we have only one user here so let's open the database oh we don't have any user so let's create also one user and user id1 let's save this one and go to the user factory go to the seeder and uh, copy this one and say here user and create one user okay let's save this one and now in the terminal, I'm going to run artisan migrate fresh dash dash seed. Okay. And if I come here, yeah, we have a user and in the post, the user ID is one. Okay. Now the idea is to get To display also the user here so one method uh, one way is that the user id and you can say here this and we need the relationship so i'm going to create that relationship this user id 
let's save this one and open the post model and make a function a user and say dollar sign return dollar sign this belong to the user class let's save this one and go to the insomnia make a get request and now we have the user id which is one okay let me go to the post and change the user id to this one to be two make a get request and now we have an error because we don't have the path user yeah now we have that okay this is one way but uh, here we just get all the posts and we don't have posts with a relationship so both with the user but uh, also i want to show you if i make again one more resource for the user so artisan make resource user resource okay that open that user resource and let's return now the same thing so here i'm going to return the id and let's say dollar sign this id the name dollar sign this name and the email It's going to be dollar sign this email okay let's save this one and now in the post resource instead of saying something like this let's say just user and say new and user resource and here we add is user okay let's save it let's go to the insomnia and refresh and now here we have the user object inside the data we have the post object and inside the post object we have the user object and here we have only the id email and the name that's we added here okay friends that's it for this video hope you enjoy and see you in the next one all the best